Hey everyone, welcome back. My name is Miller Curry, and today we're going to be walking through the newest update to Poke Bedrock. I'm so excited to show you guys this new update. It's actually really, really cool. And basically, what it is, is the Mega Evolution update. So, basically what this is, is in this update, you're going to be able to find uh, Megas, you're going to be able to find bosses, you're going to be able to Mega Evolve your Pokemon, you're going to be able to do so many things with these cool uh, 30 plus new Mega models we've added into the game. And I'm so excited to show you guys this update and for you guys to use this update in your very own worlds. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go find a random Pokemon to fight. And as you can see, I have a Rayquaza, a Haunter, a Whale Lord, and Pidgeot in my party. So what we're going to do is we're going to find... Okay, here's some Pokemon over here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a Pidgey, Pidgeotite. And we're going to set this into Pidgeot's held item. So we're just going to set Pidgeotite into the held item. I'm going to put Pidgeot into my first slot. And once we fight this person... Ignore the thing on the sidebar. There we go. What we can do is activate Mega Evolution for the next move. Then we can use Gus or any other move. And we'll be able to Mega Evolve and use that move. Boom. Now we got Pidgeot. And it used the uh, air slash and roly coly is destroyed <laughs> what a doubt but basically mega evolutions is really really cool and it's kind of amazing for people who want to have higher power moves and higher power pokemon in their game additionally you can't have mega evolutions by yourself you're going to need the supplement of a mega ring so to get a Mega Ring, you're going to be able to craft this in the crafting table. And simply equipping it into your offhand slot will allow you to Mega Evolve Pokemon inside a battle. So if we attack, max lag, we unlocked in the Pokedex, nice. You can see that I can no longer Mega Evolve because I took off the Mega Ring. Don't worry about Pidgeot's texture, we uh, don't have a shiny model for it right now. But I can switch to another Pokemon. Um, but the problem is I cannot apply the Mega Ring inside the battle, so we're going to have to run from the battle. And I'll be able to apply it once we get out of here. And then boom. So now we also should be able to find random boss Pokemon that spawn around the world. So I don't know if we'll be able to find any. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to spawn in... A boss Pokemon if we cannot find one and okay so let's say uh, boss camera spawned over here so boom it spawns epic camera spawned and we're gonna be able to fight this boss you cannot capture this Pokemon so if I throw a master ball at it won't be let me, won't let me catch but I can use my GUI on it and attack the mega camera with this, I can be able to get the stone that then if I capture this Pokemon, I, if I capture a normal one, I would be able to Mega Evolve it. Additionally, it drops some really, really good loot, and it's really good for your battle. So what we're going to do is we're going to attack. Okay, so... I don't know if we'll be able to kill this thing because it's level 130, which is kind of crazy, but uh, let's use Feather Dance. Mega Evolve Pidgeot. Let's see. Oh, nice. Alright, we got lucky. So, uh, okay. 13 chance. Uh, 
Okay, we don't got some. We don't really have some good moves on this Pokemon. I should have put some better moves on here. Let's see if we can knock him with that. Alright, boom, we are able to defeat Camera, and there we go. I have just gained 1400 XP from that, but okay. There we go, you can see some drops, uh, red standstone. Oh, we didn't get that good of drops, but we did get a Camera up to Ite. So, with this, we're going to be able, if I was, if I had, so, slots, set, smelly curry, one, Camera. Now I can, right? And we should be able to Meg, Meg evolve. Oh, Meg evolve this Pokemon in battle. So if I, ooh, I didn't apply it to the. <laughs> Oops. Oh, nice. Okay, now we'll be able to use Camera up to, and Mega evolve them inside the battle. Let's see. Activate. You can also deactivate it after you activate it, just to make sure you want it. And then we'll be able to use anything. So let's Boom. <laughs> we knew we were going to kill it. But there we go. And that is pretty much the mega system inside of Poke Bedrock. So uh, there was a few more features. I would say there's uh, Epic, Legendary, and Ultra. I'm pretty sure is that the mega, uh, the, the boss types which you can find around the world. Um, there has been 30 new models added, I'm pretty sure, in this update. We have all the stones added for all of the mega stones. We have the mega ring added. We have those crafting recipes. Um, and the ability for a new mega dex approaching soon. Um, also, this update has a boatload of bug fixes and fixes to the backpack, I would say. Backpack has been, I know it's been a problem recently. People have been reporting about it. Uh, but this should fix all the problems with the backpack. So this is what it usually would say. But um, you should be able to now set stuff into there and be fine without worrying about it getting reset. But also uh, we've done a few fixes for evolutions and all the things to do with, you know, bad problems inside of Pokey Bedrock. Uh, we hope you guys enjoy these little short videos and we hope you have an amazing time on Pokey Bedrock. And if you like this video and you want me to do more of them for each single update, leave a comment below, like the video and share it with your friends. I hope to see you on Pokey Bedrock and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace out.